great white sharks. What is it about them that I love so much? Their beauty, the way that they effortlessly glide through the water, or is it their size and girth and that they are so big yet so graceful traveling through the water? Here's a couple of recent clips of sharks getting interested in objects that I see in the ocean that they clearly also see and have a reaction to. Like this one, notice the shiny object in the water and the shark going after it. Here, the shark actually circles back around it. However, I have actually seen very large sharks in shallow water doing the same behavior as you will see in the next clip. Notice the leopard shark in the shallows in this clip, and notice that very large shark, which after measuring I estimate to be from 9 to 11 feet long, definitely one of the largest great whites I've ever seen, especially here in San Diego. And notice that this shark is in front of the reef there, which is in very shallow water, no more than 6 or 7 feet, which is incredible to see a beauty this size in that shallow of water. Here's a clip from just a few days ago. Notice those yellowtail fish. Also, notice that great white shark going up to the surface, circling them to check them out. It later notices that those fish are together are almost the same size as it, and it backs off without trying to harm those fish. One thing I've been seeing a lot more of while flying my drone in search of white sharks is other drones. In this clip, notice the two drones filming these two sharks. If you are also a drone pilot and posting YouTube videos showing the footage, please don't share the specific location publicly because we need to keep our sharks safe from things like fishermen. This clip is exactly what I'm talking about. Notice the hook in that shark's mouth. It is so sad to see these beautiful animals injured like this when they should just be able to swim in their environment naturally and without harm from other human causes. It's perhaps getting the topside shots in crystal clear water and being able to identify these juvenile great white sharks is my favorite part of filming them here in Southern California. And footage like this is exactly why I like to do this. Do you see the beautiful circle trail the shark makes? I watched in awe looking at this beauty from my drone. This behavior has been studied by scientists, and some say that it might be a result of a shark sleeping. That is really cool, and I am super intrigued to see what scientists figure out more in the future about this behavior. If you love sharks as much as I do, and support protecting them in Southern California and all around the world, show me by liking and subscribing. Also, leave a comment with any questions you have, and I will be sure to get back to you as quickly as I can. Thank you.